anybody, so I count it an honor That's right. to be standing here. Amen. 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 Y'all ready for the word? Y'all heard a lot of music. Y'all seen a lot of beautiful dancing, but it's time to hear the word. Amen. Yes. Amen. Amen. Today we celebrate Resurrection Sunday, which is the final day of Holy Week, yes. the week that changed the world forever. Yes. Webster's definition of resurrection, the act of rising, arising again as from decay or revival. We all know the story of the cross and Jesus dying to save the world, but I'm not convinced that the church is capable of accurately and efficiently explaining its meaning to the world. All right. Let's not allow another year to pass like this. Amen? Amen. Amen. Let's begin to set the scene. It was during the feast of the Passover. This is a Jewish celebration where the blood of a slain lamb was put on the doorposts of homes so that the death angel would pass over the home stamped with the blood of a lamb. Yes. Jesus, the son of God, was sent on a three hour walk on Friday morning through Jerusalem, carrying the cross on his back. Come on now. When he got to Calvary, he was nailed to an old rugged cross, mm -hmm. crowned with thorns, beaten, spit on, laughed at, and doubted. Mm -hmm. Ultimately, giving the world his last seven words and dying. Yes. Our Lord and Savior hung on the cross all night Friday night, and on Saturday was taken down, wrapped and put into a borrowed tomb with a stone to seal it. Mm -hmm. While in the tomb, Jesus received the keys to death, hell, and the grave. Aren't we glad that he did so? Yeah. Yeah. The Bible reference, yeah. Revelation 1 and 18 says, I am he that liveth and was dead, yeah. Yeah. and behold, I am yeah. alive forever. Uh -huh. Amen. And have the keys of hell and of death. Yes. 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 Now that we have the backdrop, let's see how to make sense of what it all means. John 3.16, everybody should know this by heart, says, yes. For God so loved the world yes. that he gave his only begotten Son, that whosoever believeth in him should not perish but have everlasting life. Yes. Yes. God sent his only Son to the physical realm via immaculate conception to live, teach, and ultimately give himself for the world. Mm -hmm. Jesus Christ gave himself to pay an outstanding debt he didn't even owe. Yes. Jesus died that our sins may be forgiven and to give us eternal life as part of the package of salvation. Yes. John 10 and 10 says, The thief cometh not but for to steal, kill, and destroy. Come and on. I am come yeah. that you might have life yes. and that you might yes. have it more abundantly. Yes. The reason we are able to have an abundant life and promise of victory over death is because Jesus the Christ suffered, bled, died, and rose from the dead on the mm. third day yes. with all power in his hand. Is anybody glad that he rose from the dead? to be saved is because of the cross. Mm -hmm. The Bible says in Romans 10 and 9, if thou shalt confess with thy mouth the Lord Jesus yes. and believe in thine heart that God hath raised him from the dead, thou shalt be saved. Yeah. It's that simple. Yes. You have to confess with your mouth, believe with your heart that He, God hath raised Jesus from the dead and you're saved. Amen? Amen. Amen. Yes. 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 Jesus loved you enough and cared about your soul's final resting state that he gave his life. Every sin you've ever committed or will ever commit is nailed to the cross. Yes, every yes, lie yes. you've ever told, yes. every evil word you've ever said, every count of wrongdoing against you was nailed to the cross. Yes. You are now free from every penalty. The Bible declares in Romans 8 and 1, there is that, therefore now no condemnation to them which are in Christ Jesus who walk not after the flesh, but after the spirit. Yes. This simply means because of the blood that was shed on Calvary's cross over 2,000 years ago, you are no longer prisoner of the sin you have committed. Once you're under the blood, the devil can no longer hold your yeah. hands over your head. Yeah. You yeah. are free. The Bible says who the Son has made free is free yeah. indeed. Yeah. 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 Romans 8, 38 and 39 yeah. says, For I am persuaded that neither Hallelujah. death nor life, uh, yeah. nor angels nor principalities, nor powers yeah. nor things present, nor things to come, yeah. nor height nor death, yeah. nor shall be able to separate us from the love of God, which is in Christ Jesus, our Lord. Hallelujah. Today we celebrate the resurrection of our Savior and his ascension into heaven. Know that Jesus died for you, but is not dead. Jesus is alive and seated at the right hand of his Father, 
patiently waiting to return for his people. Yes. Yes. John 14, 2 and 3 says, In my Father's house there are many mansions. Many mansions. Yes. If we're not so, oh, we're not okay. have told yes. you. Yes. I go to prepare a place for you, and if I go and prepare a place for you, I will come again and receive you unto okay. myself, yes. that where I am, ye may be also. Yes. Yes. Amen? Amen. Amen. In closing, he rose and lives, and, ha- and we have an opportunity to gain eternal life through the promise of the cross. Yes. Take Jesus up on his offer and allow him into your heart as the risen king in your life. No grave could hold him, just as no grave yes. will hold us when the trumpet sounds. Oh, yeah. I would like to leave you with 1 Corinthians 15, 51, it, it. and through 58, which yes. Yes. reads, Yes, yes. Yes. Behold, I show you a mystery. Yes. I, we shall not, not all sleep, not but we sleep. shall be changed yes. in a moment in the twinkling of an eye. Incorruptible, and we shall be yes. changed.